All right, hello, and welcome back to another episode of the Sunhaven Bedless Challenge. First off, we're gonna get our mail. I'm not gonna read some of this. It's our weekly food delivery. I feel like it's gonna come every week. It doesn't really need to be read. But with that out of the way, we're gonna ignore our grapes really quickly. And just water these plants here. Which reminds me, last time, and most times, I regret when I water or I harvest. Because I end up accidentally watering fully grown crops and then regretting it. And I've been playing a lot of other games recently, so... I might fumble around a little bit with which buttons I press. Fully accidental, but these things happen. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and actually plant these grapes here. We do need to infuse them. But we should be good. There we go. Oh, we don't have the mana for that one. We will by the time we're done watering. And we also need to make sure to gather up all of our water every time. In my head, the water was going to last a lot longer. It's just been a minute since I've played, so I was like, yeah, our water will last forever. And that just simply isn't the case. There we go. We infused our last one. Perfect. And it looks like we have a lot going on, because not only do we have a request to get raspberries, we need a loom. We've got the little rocks around our base. We've got our fully grown grapes. We will be kept plenty busy. For now, I'm going to ignore all the things and just go ahead and gather all these grapes i know we have a rocky friend but we're gonna ignore them for a bit okay farming level and we can get earthquake alchemy table furniture crafting and zookeeper we don't have any barn animals and we won't for a while um we're gonna learn alchemy. There we go. With that, let's look to see what it takes to make a loom. Ah. Well, we can make one. We're gonna be low on fabric material now. If there's any just sitting around. Oh well, we will face that later. What I will do, jump over here, we can use our magic again now because I have infused everything I want to infuse. Do we have any raspberry plants over here? I don't think so, but I don't recall off the top of my head if they exist here. I'm just really quickly gonna go a little bit into the forest on this side. Touch. Hello? Are any of you raspberry trees? No? Are you sure none of you are raspberry trees? Okay, this looks like a solid not raspberry trees. Okay. Well, we had to get our cardio in somehow, right? up here though. Okay. 
Oh wow. This guy just straight up blocked himself off. I didn't want to be a part of whatever we're doing. And our loom is done. Wonderful. Let me go to this chest. Wait, take this off. There we go. We also have 40 gold worth of dead crops on us. Um, so perhaps that could be useful later. For now, we are going to go south first before we go north because there could be... There's a raspberry. We just desperately need raspberries right now. That's really why. I don't even remember who these raspberries are for. Mian. Okay. Mian, I have raspberries for you. We can use the blueberries to, uh... Gift. As an affection earning gift. Cool. Okay. Where is everyone? It looks like on the east side of town over there. Alright. We'll finish their quest. And then... Deal with whatever comes next. Oh right, I'm out of mana. Oh, and it's Sunday, which means we can get another uh, blessing from the fat. Hello, I have brought what you wanted. All right, this will be fun. You're the best farmer. Here, take this in return. I don't know how much it's worth, but I poured my heart into it. Uh, farming experience, please. Oh, right, wallpaper. And we got a level in exploration. Um, the extra silk. Um, right, we do want all the recipes. Oh no, we're already past that. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, we're gonna actually work on getting our community tokens. Um, we have use for those. Then Mian should be right up here. Right? No. Yes. He actually visits the museum. No one visits the museum. Hello? Mian, are you here? Mian? Are you looking at our culture? It's very, uh, cultured. Oh, you sure are. Hello. Oh, you brought me raspberries? Thank you so much, Blaze. Oh, it's gonna be perfect again now. Here, take this. You deserve it. No problem. Farming experience, please. Oh, we have money right now. Oh no. Well, we may as well finish every other quest we can finish while we have money. And then go shopping. Because we all know money is something that's meant to be spent before it vanishes before our eyes. No, actually, I think that's just unique to my experience here. There we go. We have bonus mana. Oh yeah. Edwin, I have brought you grapes. I also just jumped into a bridge pole. Fine. Hello. <laughs> you again, farmer? Look, I was a little hazy earlier when I told you to grow those grapes. I know you can't actually grow them, I was just... Wait, you actually grew them? I guess I was wrong. Seems you really are what the tavern rumors say. Well, a deal's a deal. Please pay off my tab. Now I suppose I owe you. The truth is, Farmer, the poem really doesn't mean anything. It's just a simple element poem. I don't understand how that helps me. Well, it wasn't for nothing, Farmer. I know the Nelvar Nelvarians hold the ancient way of the elves, a connection with nature, in deep regard. Only those who understand that will ever be able to enter their city. 
anything proves you have a connection with nature. Definitely ain't no bedtime poem. It's your ability to grow grapes like bees. Yeah, I'll wager that you win, no doubt. I guess that makes sense. Ah, <laughs> see? Chin up, farmer. You did good. I should go in. Find the ancient lost city of the Navari elves. As for me, I think we'll open a new tab. <laughs> Thanks, I think. You're offering me money. Um, I shouldn't have money, so I'll take fishing experience. Have I leveled up my fishing? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I want fish to come towards my hook faster. That sounds good. Um, and then we need to speak to Lucia. Is she in the town hall? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Wait, no, before I forget. Hello, Renard. What services do you provide? What are you selling? I would like some elixirs of speed. Right, yes. I will take two of them. Thank you. And I'm going to drink them in front of you. I feel like drink is kind of a strong word when I just, like, apparently swallow them bottle and all. Wait, no. Why am I... How did I manage to get lost in the town hall? That's quite a feat. Hello. I did stuff. Hello, Blaze. It's good we ran into each other. I've wanted to ask you how mana infusing went. Did you succeed? Really? I'm quite glad to hear that. Is your next step to search for the Nelvari then? Great. I'm glad I caught you before you left. And Blaze, if it isn't too much trouble for you, would you please meet me at the barracks before you leave for Nelvari? Nathaniel and I would like to see you off before you begin your travels. Sure. I'll see you there. To the barracks. We have... Uh, a send-off to get to? At this rate, I'm kind of just hoping it's money because I have a lot of it and the more I have, the more I can spend. Ah, Blaze, you're here. Thank you for coming. Hello, Blaze. Glad you've come, too. Hello, both of you. I didn't want to take up too much of your time, Blaze. I simply wanted to commend you before you head out to find Navari. You've done a lot of you've done a lot for Sunhaven already, and I know you'll continue to do more as you go forward. As a show of thanks, please accept this token on behalf of Sunhaven. I've placed an enchantment on this seal that will aid you in your mana infusing endeavors. Don't act so shy, you deserve it. You seem to be doing much to ensure the safety of Sunhaven Blaze. You have the thanks of me and everyone else here today, inside the barracks, and outside of the barracks too. So more than just me and Lucia. <laughs> And, uh, because I didn't know we'd be giving out gifts. Let me see. Nathaniel, I don't think you need to... Ah, here they are. Please accept these soldier boots on behalf of Sunhaven Guard. Perfectly crafted for long marches. You get anywhere quicker. Blaze, you're doing something that no, no one in Sunhaven history has done before. Just remember to stay safe and be careful. The forests of the West are not well charted or mapped, and no one can tell for certain what you might face. Several of my men have scouted into the western forest. They've told me that the trees begin to turn a strange, vibrant color. They also feel a strange presence on the wind. Sounds a little eerie to me, so keep your cool as you look for the elves. Thank you both! I won't hold you up any longer, Blaze. You know that I'll have a very long road ahead of you. I've said everything I've needed to. Good luck out there, Blaze. we will off to search for Navari. I mean, like... Probably not today, but soon? Today, I think we're gonna just spend the rest of our day at our farm, having a relaxing time, cutting down all the things, keeping everything nice and clean. First, we have to spend all our money. It's an important process to spend all your money every day. Hello, I'm here to spend all my money. What are you selling? Okay, okay. Ooh. Oh no. Does shimmer root grow in summer? It does. I don't have the money for shimmer root though. Um. I wish I knew. 
which plants I needed. I'm gonna go ahead and go for Cinnaberry. And Kale. And just hope that I'm right, and apparently also a Choco Berry. There we are. Um, we also have this seal of Sunhaven. You may discard this item. Wonderful! Our max mana was permanently increased by 10. And we also were given boots. Um, we're not actually wearing any boots, so I will gladly take those. Nine days to grow, grow since spring. This one takes the highest number of days to grow, so we'll make sure to plant that one today. And we'll have more spots open up tomorrow because the grapes grow in a single day, and we planted some of those. We are? Okay. So I think first thing first is we're going to get ourselves access back to up here so that we can inspect the sign and see how long we have with our new rocky friend. Rarg. Who are you? Rarg. How much of a talker, huh? Would you please leave my farm? They really seem to want to leave. The monster didn't seem like he'll be going anywhere soon. Better act fast before he keeps messing up my farm. Uh, I think I know some people who could help me out. Okay. And this one? We have until the 20th. So. We'll deal with them tomorrow. Today we're going to deal with other things, pre-existing, trees, weeds, we'll leave rocks alone for today I think. Also take this moment if you haven't already to go ahead please like this video, maybe subscribe to this channel, and leave a comment, and let me know what types of rocks do you like, if you like rocks, and if you don't like rocks. Um, wow, it's a really broad category of things you don't like. Honestly, I'm impressed. Just be like, I don't like rocks, angry face. Because I feel like technically gems could be considered rocks. And then there's just like straight up rock rocks. Yeah. Right now I'm thinking about fun rocks. I kind of like the ones that are like, um, the petrified wood rock. Is it technically wood or rocks? I don't know. But I like petrified wood. I think it's fun. It's very fascinating. One thing I'm not as huge of a fan of is um, diamonds. Not a fan. Um, and the reason why isn't because diamonds are a problem. Uh, no. It's that humans in regards to diamonds are the problem. Otherwise, I would think diamonds are cool because, like, they're formed under a ton of pressure and that's pretty awesome. Otherwise, like, really, really smooth rocks just make me happy. Oh, we got a griffin egg. I wonder if we have one yet. I don't remember what all we've donated to the museum. Hello, I would like your silk. And your silk. Thank you. Go ahead and cut ah, this tree down. 
Oh, I like that when we're cutting this one down, it like was facing in front of the other tree. And I think... Probably... I might... Very soon be doing... What I can only describe as a training montage video. So that should be fun and exciting. Look forward to it. Obviously, I want to make sure that we have our talk with Lynn and Nathaniel. And probably our fight with this here giant rock up top. But then, training montage time. We have to get strong before we are prepared to leave. Like, I know we had our original testing before we were even given our quest, but... I want additional training. I want to be the very best. Like no one ever- wait, nope, that's Pokemon. Well, we'll be good enough. And I have various fruits in my pocket, so I should be able to give um, the doctor something other than apple as a present, which I'm sure is appreciated. He doesn't seem to like receiving apples as presents, which honestly, valid. You passed out. Bye, money. It was nice knowing you. Hey, look at how much money we earned yesterday. Good morning. Good day to watch the windmills. It sure is. Would you like an orange? Thanks for the orange. Surprises are always nice. No sweat. There we go. And now we can give gifts with selfish reasons because who doesn't like to be a selfish gift giver? <laughs> okay, roosting season. You want a wooden table? I think we can do that. Will of iron, and you want iron ore? We cannot do that. Sorry, Emma. It's just, it can't be done. We are too iron poor for that. We're living in our copper era. <laughs> Alright, but with that, we'll be wrapping up for the week. I will see you all next week. After we get roared at. Of course. It's very important. To get. Roared at. Yep. With that. Be wonderful to yourselves. Be wonderful to one another. Have a fabulous week. Goodbye. <laughs>